Close President Donald Trump revoked the security clearance of former CIA Director John Brennan and is considering revoking the security clearances of several other Obama-era officials. USATODAYWASHINGTON, wasting no time, ex-CIA Director John Brennan said Thursday that President Donald Trump revoked his security clearance this week to try and silence him for speaking out against Trump's friendliness with Russians who influenced the 2016 election, Mr. Trump's claims of no collusion are, in a word, hogwash. Brennan wrote in a New York Times op-ed published the day after the White House announced revocation of his security clearance. Brennan cited Trump's call on Russia in July of 2016 to release emails from the private account of Democratic opponent Hillary Clinton. Trump later said he was joking, but Brennan wrote that the comment makes one wonder what Mr. Trump privately encouraged his advisers to do, and what they actually did, to win the election, over Clinton. Said Brennan, the only questions that remain are whether the collusion that took place constituted criminally liable conspiracy, whether obstruction of justice occurred to cover up any collusion or conspiracy, and how many members of Trump Incorporated attempted to defraud the government by laundering and concealing the movement of money into their pockets. Trump, who has denied collusion or obstruction of justice with respect to the Russia investigation, said he revoked Brennan's security clearance because of erratic statements about the Russia case. Brennan has leveraged his CIA experience and access to information to make a series of unfounded and outrageous allegations, wild outbursts on the internet and television, about this administration, Trump said in a written statement. More, Donald Trump revokes former CIA director John Brennan's security clearance related on politics today. Trump pulls his critics' security clearance late Thursday. A dozen former senior intelligence officials, including recent former CIA heads David Petraeus, Leon Panetta and Michael Hayden, came to Brennan's defense, issuing a joint statement calling Trump's decision an attempt to stifle free speech. We feel compelled to respond in the wake of the ill-considered and unprecedented remarks and actions by the White House regarding the removal of John Brennan's security clearances, the official statement read. We know John to be an enormously talented, capable, and patriotic individual who devoted his adult life to the service of this nation. Trump also said he is reviewing the security clearances of other Barack Obama administration officials he has accused of trumping up Russia allegations in a bid to undermine his presidency. The president has also accused these officials of going easy on Clinton in an investigation of her emails. The president's list includes former FBI Director James Comey, former National Intelligence Director James Clapper, former CIA Director Michael Hayden, former National Security Advisor Susan Rice, as well as other ex-FBI officials involved in the Russia investigation. The president has denounced the investigation headed by Special Counsel Robert Mueller as a hoax perpetrated by Democrats. After his announcement, Trump took to Twitter to quote commentators who supported his action against Brennan. I'd strip the whole bunch of them, said Fox News commentator Sean Hannity. They've all betrayed the American people with a political agenda. They tried to steal and influence an election in the United States, I'd strip the whole bunch of them. They're all corrupt. They've all abused their power. They've all betrayed the American people with a political agenda. They tried to steal and influence an election in the United States, at Sinhana T. Donald J. Trump, at Real Donald Trump, August 16, 2018. The officials listed by Trump said they are pursuing the truth about the president in Russia and will not be silenced. The larger implication here is the jeopardy to our First Amendment rights, Clapper said Thursday on CNN. There's a very chilling message here to people in the intelligence community, in his New York Times op-ed. Brennan said Trump is also trying to intimidate prosecutors, but predicted he would not be successful, Mr. Trump clearly has become more desperate to protect himself and those close to him, which is why he made the politically motivated decision to revoke my security clearance in an attempt to scare and to silence others who might dare to challenge him, Brennan said. Close former CIA chief John Brennan, the day after having his security clearance revoked by President Trump, penning an op-ed in the New York Times, titled, President Trump's Claims of No Collusion or Hogwash, viewers Nick Cardona has the details.
Buzz 60 contributing, Ryan W. Miller, USA Today read or share this story, https colon slash slash usat.ly slash tuvinbear.